Hey everyone, uh, my name is Lane Blank. I'm the manager of agronomic services for Southwest Saskatchewan. I'm just going to quickly talk to you about the importance of phosphorus on your pulses. Uh, so when we talk about false phosphorus on your pulses, uh, I like to start with the very basics and that is yield. It's the whole reason why we grow crops is to get yield. Uh, so you got to know how much FOSS per bushel of pulses you need. So for example, for lentils, you need 0.8 pounds per bushel of crop. So for a 40 bushel lentil crop, you're going to need 32 pounds of phosphorus. Uh, and peas are very similar. Uh, so once you know that, the best thing to do is just go take a soil sample and send it to the lab and then you're going to know exactly what is in your soil and you can apply phosphorus based on your uh, soil sample lab results. Uh, so the importance of phosphorus in your pulses, you really need that FOSS to get improved seedling vigor and root growth. Uh, so improved seedling vigor is going to help uh, defend against those early season uh, diseases such as root rots and your damping off. Uh, you're also going to get very good root growth from increased phosphorus and that is going to be very important when we're talking about uh, nodulation and we will get to that in my next minute. Um, but we also know that an increased root ma mass is definitely going to help with uh, defend against those early season diseases and help with nutrient uptake. 